Some great news for Connecticut. Electric Boat won a $9.5 billion contract to start building the next class of Columbia submarines. In fact, 12 subs will be built over the next 20 years. Chief Capital reporter Susan Raff is taking us to Groton, where thousands of jobs will be created. Construction has started not on the submarines themselves, but on the facility to build them. Electric Boat is building a 200,000 foot structure where 12 new submarines will be built. Our organization is 17,000 today. Uh, it will become 20,000 uh, by the time 2030 rolls around and we're in full scale production. The new Columbia class of submarines will replace the aging Ohio class. Those were built in the 80s. The submarines are massive, 560 feet long. Standing up, that's about five feet taller than the Washington Monument. Uh, this is highly complex manufacturing, maritime manufacturing, uh, building it out into the river because the, the uh, modular pieces are going to get barged up. These submarines will strengthen national security. Chinese submarines aren't as good as U.S. submarines. Russian submarines are not as good as U.S. submarines, but they are getting better. They are producing more. And so it is incumbent upon us to keep up. It is huge and historic because it begins a new era in submarine building. Other states will get some of the work, but about 50% will be done right here in Connecticut. The first sub is expected to be delivered to the U.S. Navy in 2027. This is a huge undertaking and a big win for Connecticut. All of this will be hopefully built in two years, creating thousands of jobs, which will create enough work the next two decades. In Groton, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.